Now we'll move on to our final story of the night. Kokesh held without bond for a crime of filming himself performing an utterly harmless, quote, crime. And the article reads, a D.C. Superior Court judge has ordered that a veteran and activist accused of openly carrying a shotgun in D.C.'s Freedom Plaza, that's an oxymoron, held without bond. During a preliminary hearing Monday, an attorney representing Adam Kokesh argued that the stunt filmed and posted on YouTube was nothing more than a political theater show. And then the judge said this, I disagree. I consider your client to be a very dangerous man. The judge said, this is not a political statement. So exercising your rights at a very corrupt law that has actually been overturned is not a political statement. It makes you a very dangerous man in D.C. So hopefully we can get some freedom for Adam Kokesh, some justice. And he went on the Alex Jones, well, he wasn't on the Alex Jones radio show, but Alex commented on this a little bit earlier today. And he said that Kokesh said basically the drugs were planted. Uh, you know, he says, yes, I did have the shotguns and so forth in my home. And he had a very nice gun safe. I wish I had a gun safe like that. But he said not the, the mushrooms and all the other drug paraphernalia. That was not his. That was planted evidence. And we've talked to the lawyers who said that this stuff was planted as well because the police and the other forces came in and with big bags and basically planted the evidence. So hopefully we can get some justice and get to the bottom of this very unfortunate situation. We'll move now to our quote of the day. This is from Benjamin Franklin. Where liberty is, there is my country. And that is from Benjamin Franklin. Now, Operation Paul Revere is our film contest, and it's finally coming to a close. Today on the Alex Jones Radio Show, we announced the third place winner. And you can see it right there. The, uh, the cash prize is the 5000 for the third place. The second place is going to be uh, announced tomorrow, and then the first place the next day. But congratulations. To Political Earth, your third place winner right there. It's a great film, great animated film. Definitely encourage you to go to infowars.com forward slash P and watch that for yourself. And like I said, the uh, first and second place are going to be announced in the coming days, so stay tuned for that. But if you'd like to support filmmakers like the people in the Operation Paul Revere contest, you can stop by the InfoWars shop and pick up State of Mind. You can see it right there on your screen for $19.95. The Blu-ray is just $5 extra. It's a great film. It gives you the, uh, the psychology of control. It has many people in it. It has Alex Jones as well as many others, so definitely check that out at the InfoWars shop. And also, if you want to support us, stop by PrisonPlanet.tv, and you can actually watch State of Mind on PrisonPlanet.tv, as well as many other things as the Alex Jones radio show, the nightly news, the special reports, and all that is right there on PrisonPlanet.tv. Now stay tuned, because right after this break, we'll be back with Gigi Arnetta, and she's going to be talking to Mike Zullo. He has more information about the Obama birth certificate. And after that, stay tuned. We're going to have another Paul Revere entry. This one is The Futurist. It's a great film. You can see it right there on Infowars.com forward slash P. And you can see both those right after this break. Now you can watch Alex Jones live at Infowars.com forward slash show. You'll find links to all of our content there and a free 15-day trial for Prison Planet TV. You can also browse the network, the Infowars Nightly News, and over 60 movies and documentaries all together in one place. You can watch the Alex Jones Radio Show live as it happens. So check it out, Infowars.com forward slash show.